So. Strange creatures in the sea. What? We feel the presence of the vortex kind. When will we swim in peace again? I'm a little upset over their uh, over their shark design, by the way. It's a good design, don't get me wrong, and it, it's beautiful artwork. My issue is that the old sharks, their teeth kind of hung out of their mouths, and they had this snarl to them at all times, this sort of just angry snarl. And here, they just look um, neutral, just completely neutral. Same with Echo, actually. Echo Sprite looks a lot more uh, neutral, whereas in the first game, he seemed more innocent and happy and 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 you know he he had kind of like a grin to him uh but uh, and even then his his color palette was so bright that all the darkness that you'd be in it, it was so weirdly juxtaposed like i'm just an innocent kid uh, you know it's like that that Simpton, simpsons meme of <laughs> i'm in danger um it had this sort of innocence juxtaposed over so many uh you know just dark dangerous things in the water which was even creepier, but now he's, I guess Echo's seen so much crap in the first game that he's just, like, he's war-hardened. He looks a lot more war-hardened now. Uh, you know, he looks a lot, um, a lot tougher. So maybe this is part of Echo's arc. He, he's, uh, you know, he, he, he's stronger. So. What's that? What's that doing here? This thing will kill me in one hit if I try to charge at it, but I'm going to try. Oh, man. Those things are hard to kill. Oh, man. There is nothing you can do. All right. Sonaring them regularly won't do a thing, so the only way you can kill them is to... You didn't see it because it happened so fast, but the way to kill them is, is sonar kill. And it is for sure dead. It's gone. But, um... There is a little bit of a glitch when killing them. Hang on, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna kill myself on purpose here just to show you the glitch. This glitch can bite you in the ass if, uh, if you're not paying attention. Awesome. Oh, they saved the real... They saved the dolphin agony sound for when you die. It's... I hate that sound. Okay. <laughs> now, if you kill a vortex creature in one of these normal levels, uh, that's in the side-scrolling levels, your sonar works just fine. But when you're not side-scrolling, sonar does nothing unless you're unless you use the charge first. But if you sonar, it's when it dies, it leaves behind a bunch of stars. Like all, all creatures in this game, every time they die, there's like little stars left behind. If you sonar at those stars, it'll make a different death animation of going blah and, and, and blow up in four different pieces. If you do that, the thing will pretty much all, uh, almost immediately respawn the moment you leave the, the area. Watch. Do you see that? Now watch. When I leave and come back, it's back. So you got to be very careful. Now if I leave and come back, it's not there. But maybe I have to really leave. It's it's totally gone. So I have to illustrate that bug for you because it may bite you in the ass. Uh, there is another level with a lot of these vortex creatures in them, and um, it, it it gonna hurt uh, if you're not careful. <laughs>
need that anymore. So let's come back over here. Get the crystal one more time. And, uh... Uh, there's also a new feature to this game, uh, uh, a power-up that didn't exist before. Look at this thing. Let's get a look at it on the sonar map so you know what it looks like. Looks like uh, twin sonars. Um, let's sing to it. Uh, this thing enhances your attacks. Your sonar attacks, that is. So if I sonar, I get a regular sonar. But if I mash the A button... Pretty cool. All right, before I continue, I'm gonna surface for some air real quick. Now, over here, ah, oh, the current is too tough, but there's a turtle that swims over it. I wonder what would happen if I, oh. And I forget what game that was first introduced. I want to say that same feature was in uh, was in Echo for Sega CD, but I, I don't remember. Anyway. What? Okay. The distant future, or one possible future. Why do I get the feeling she talks like William Shatner? I am from the distant future, or one possible future. There is another possible future, a dark future, the vortex future. <laughs> You're old. Uh, all right, she's going to take me to. All right. You must touch me to trap. Okay. Nah, I'm going to be G-rated. Um, so, this crazy-looking god goddess angel dolphin thing is apparently the next evolution of what dolphins will look like in the future. Apparently, they have time travel, and uh, you're about to see the world, the world that could be. What she's basically telling you is, is that there is a chance that another future could happen. A really dark, post-apocalyptic, terrible-looking future. But she's going to show you uh, the happy ending. So if you, if you play your cards right, this is what the world could look like. There we go. We're getting flushed into the toilet of time. <laughs> 